hey, how's it going? Well, I finally got that movie pass thing in the mail. The card finally came in. So uh, I went to see Black Panther today. It's not normally a movie I'd watch uh, because it's in that whole Marvel universe. But I really enjoyed it. I'd I'd give it a four out of five stars. Um, Acting was good. The plot was good. The casting was good. Um, I I emotionally felt for the characters. Um, That's a pretty important thing in a movie. You know, I, I... the characters, most of them were relatable. There are some that aren't because they don't get enough screen time for you to actually get their personality, but um, impressed. Four out of five stars, I'd say. Um, the things that kind of took away f- from it are, I don't know what it is. I don't know why these studios just feel the need to do it. You know, let's put some computer animated animals in it. No, stop, stop, don't do it. Just stop. Okay, they're never going to look totally real. You're, you're not going to get it down exactly. Stop ruining the movie by putting things in there that don't even need to be in there. They did not need to have computer animated rhinos in the movie. It wasn't necessary. Um, one area that obviously seems to piss some people off is that it speaks negatively of colonialism. It speaks negatively of the history of the United States. And... Well, that sort of thing is a uh, makes it a no go for some people because uh, some people feel that you can't talk negatively about the history of the United States or you hate this country, which is it's it's bullshit. But that's what some people do. That's how some people feel. And so, for the people that can't stand any movie that speaks negatively about the history of the United States, yeah, you probably shouldn't see this movie because it'll piss you off. Another thing about it is the last quarter of the movie, they could have turned into an entirely other movie and made made the plot get a little bit more interesting. They to be as generic as I can, the bad guys um could have had their plan come a lot more into fruition. Um a lot more. And I think that would have made the the last section of the movie a lot more enjoyable. But when the when you get into that time crunch, you know, of the last part of the movie, they well, you know, they're gonna they're gonna have to cut some corners somewhere. So, you know, eh. so the the computer animated rhinos and the way the last quarter of the movie seemed like they could have just made it a little more. I said, made the bad guy's plan come a little more into fruition, and and I would have given it a five out of five stars. But, uh, hey, four out of five stars isn't bad. It's pretty damn good. I, I highly recommend the movie. So... <laughs>